Hi, welcome back to my channel. The ticking that you hear is the haunted matching clock from Disneyland. Go through a flip through of my cousin. So this is what I am doing. And I have my Hobonichi pin underneath it. Oh, I don't wanna push them out too far. So this is what I am doing for this week. This is how I am laying it out. And I had some things I needed to do today. So this video is gonna be uploaded a little bit late. Um, but this is the way I decided to lay it out. Packages I put over here. This is what I did for last week. And the week before, I can't remember what I did that Saturday. And then for the, was this the first or second? Yeah, kind of like the first week of February, second week of February, did not keep up. And then this is the first week of February. So as you can see, um, as I say in my other videos, in case you haven't watched those, I am not shy with the washi tape or the stickers. I do have a lot and uh, my goal is to try to use them up. And um, so I went back to this layout just because I feel like I can, um, I don't know, be more productive with this way. So now let's go to February. And I have been taping in um, comic pages from the far side and then printing out photos. So this is the first day of February. I started to do the Hobonichi challenge for February and I think the prompts were about Japan. So I started to do that. And so I sketched it in with pencil first before I went in uh, with a black pen. And then there's the comic strip for the first day of February. Kept going. I meant to watercolor it in, but of course I didn't. And then this is where I started putting in my photos. So this is Kit Kat, the neighborhood cat. There's Bruce. That is a red dragon amaryllis. This is the six. So Bruce is asleep. We're trying new paint colors on the house. And then my husband built me a, um, I guess, is it iron? It's a metal um, clothes rack, hanging rack that I wanted. Instead of buying one from Amazon, he made me one that's really strong. And so um, I don't know if you can see what it looks like in there. This is a birthday cake. It's an ice cream cake. This is Gomer and Goober. It, they are my two elephant palms. And then I need to put photos in here. Here's the red dragon in full bloom now. It was really pretty. The flowers were really big. These are flower buds from um, a citrus tree that my mom started from seed a few years ago. And I gave it some Epsom salt and some fertilizer. And then they popped out some flower blooms. Planted some seeds. This is my wall of elbows, Monstera Albo Borgiana. That's Bruce. You're gonna hear him walking around. So that's what this looks like. That's Bruce, is he showing up? <laughs> He's showing up. Don't take him, Bruce. Is it dark? Okay, it's not. Uh, this is a, hi Bruce. This is a Hoya Carrii, I think it's what it's called. My husband bought it for me for Valentine Day, Valentine's Day. I hope you guys had a nice day if you celebrate it. Um, we generally don't celebrate it, but we did go shopping that day because he was off of work. And um, yeah, so we went, he took me to a nursery and I happened to find this at the nursery. So I picked one up and it was really cheap, which I really appreciated. Kit Kat, there's Berry's Crazy Cherry. If you like growing tomatoes, I highly recommend that one. And as you can see, uh, this is the way that I decorate my cousin. This is uh, A5 in size. And he's gonna probably start squeaking his toy here in a little bit. Um, and so if you wanna tip in photos, you can do it like this. I place invisible tape on top. There's the cat on the 17th. So 
so you can see how I do it. I don't necessarily um, write a lot on days where I don't have much to say. And I painted the beans in my what I'm calling my library. And um, so it initially looked like this, and then we painted the beans. So my husband helped paint maybe like 5%, but I did the rest of it myself. And you can see my plants are down here. This window's east facing, that one is south. And so it gets really good intense light, specifically from that window. And then this is the 22nd. This is a lemon tree that I have in the back. Uh, it's been really cold. It was really cold last week, um, where our nighttime temperatures was close to freezing. And I am in Los Angeles, which is kind of strange, but it did get really cold. And so on Tuesday, I found a little lizard in the back and he spent his energy running towards me um, before he stopped and so I saved him. I uh, picked him up. So this is what he looks like. And he's probably about maybe three or four inches long. I do have lizards in the back garden and they're small. Um, and we do have that cat that likes little, you know, likes going after things. And so I um, put him in this little container for the night. I do have a sun lamp for my red slider turtle, Bert. And uh, so I gave it to him to let him use the little lizard. So he's right there. So as you can see the progression as he was getting the sun from the sun lamp, uh, he started to get up and warming himself up. And so I kept him Tuesday. And then on Wednesday, I let him go. He was looking much, much better. He is called a Western fence lizard and he's got blue. He's got blue under his belly. And so that's what he looked like. I gave him some sun outside before I let him go in the um, in the garden in the back so that the cat couldn't find him. Here's me and Bruce over here. And then the cat brought home a new toy for Bruce. So somebody's missing a toy in the neighborhood. Um, but yeah, so that's a new one. And then here's the cat asleep. And that is it for my very quick flip through of my cousin. I hope you've been doing well. Thank you for the new subscribers that I have. And thank you to my current subscribers who stayed with my channel. As you've noticed, I have not been uploading a lot um, this month, this year. But it's been, it's been kind of a busy, busy month. My husband was sick with the flu. And I, was, I actually had jury duty. I was on call for a week. And so... That was interesting. Anyways, if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. Subscribe if you would like to see more videos like this. I am hoping to be a bit more active and post more, but at minimum, you will get another video next month at the end of the month to show you what I've done for March. So take care, and I will see you guys when I see you. Thank you. Bye.